regional dialect meme. Here's Glasgow. So say these words. Ant. First one's a homophone. Right. Is it ant the insect? Is it ant the relative? It's the latter. It's ant the relative. Think. Second word. Root. Is it root the part of a tree? No, it's root the stage of a journey that you take. Okay? Wash. Wash. Either or. Glasgow. Uh, oil. Theatre. Iron. Salmon. Caramel. Fire. Water. Water. Again, depends on the register you're in at the time. Sure. Sure, as in to be certain, not to be confused with sure, um, the coast, or sure, the poly. Uh, data. Ruin. Crayon. Pilot. Nolens. Uh, pecan. Both. Again. Probably. Spit an image. Glottal stop. Alabama. Lawyer. Coupon. Good, good, uh, means face, your coupon. Uh, mayonnaise, syrup, pa- That's not how you fucking spell pyjamas for a start. It's got a Y in it. That's how I'm writing it down. Pyjamas. Caught. Again, caught as in to have been. Caught. Captured. Not the thing you stick away in. Right. Uh, now answer these questions. What is it called when you throw toilet paper at a house. It's called throwing toilet paper at a house. It's called a waste of fucking paper. Is what we don't have a word for that because we're not stupid. Um, what is the bug called that when you touch it, it curls into a ball? For starters, it's not a bug. It's not even an insect. It's a woodlouse. They're arthropods, right? Yeah, they're sort of crustaceans, I think, actually. Um, they're crabs rather than... Uh, just stop calling everything a fucking bug, right? Bugs are a sub-categorization of insects. The hemiptera, true bugs, they're, um, they've got mad mouth parts, and that's how you know they're bugs, right? There's about 80,000 different species of them, so, you know, there's enough to be going on with for bugs without lumping every fucking thing that goes along in more than four legs as a bug. No. Stop it, okay? Uh, what is the bubbly carbonated drink called? Champagne? Look, I can see what you're trying to do with that question, right? What is the class of carbonated soft drinks called? Have you ever seen a non bubbly carbonated drink? It's kind of a feature of carbonated drinks that they are bubbly, okay? What you're asking me here is about carbonated soft drinks, which are called ginger, right? Not uh, ginger. Next question. What do you call gym shoes? Right, um, they'd be called plimsolls if anyone ever talked about gym shoes rather than trainers, which is what they've been sort of superseded by and done away with for. When I was young, now I'm not condoning this, they were called packy two bobs. That's just what you called them because you didn't know any better. Now that's not an acceptable term, right? Um, this was long after the <laughs> shillings uh, ceased to exist, which is what a bob was. It was a shilling, it was five old pence, and so something that was two bob was 10p. So what you're saying is that these shoes are of Pakistani origin, which was, you know, oh no, they're cheap, wacky racism there, kids, and that they cost 10 pence. Packy two bobs, but they were actually called plimsolls, but nobody ever wears the fucking thing, so it's irrelevant, okay? Um, what do you say to address a group of people? Uh, Your Honour, ladies and gentlemen of the jury, um, I think this question is about a collective form of you, like, uh, I would say, use. 
um, Americans might say y'all, depending on where you're from. Yous, we have the, yeah, um, a lot of England doesn't have anything, they just say you, but we say yous. Um, what do you call the kind of spider that has an oval shaped body and extremely long legs? We call that a spider. I mean, if you're mentally unhinged, you might call it a daddy long legs, but a daddy long legs is a kind of fly. It is a crane fly. That's a daddy long legs. A spider is a spider. If you're calling a spider a daddy long legs, you're a mental. What do you call your grandparents? My grandparents are dead. When they were alive, I called them Gran and Grandpa. And Gran. I never knew my other grandpa. He died before I was born. If he'd been alive, I'd have called him Grandpa too. Not Grandpa too, like, you know, um, Electric Boogaloo, just Grandpa. What do you call the wheeled contraption in which you carry groceries at the supermarket? First off, they're not groceries, they're your shopping or your messages, right? Messages, shopping, uh, and they go in a shopping trolley or a trolley, yeah? Not a cart, trolley. What do you call it when rain falls while the sun is shining? Monday through Thursday? Um, I don't know that we have a word for that. I would like it if we had a word for that. That'd be a good thing to have a word for. Um, no, we don't, we don't have a word for that. What is the thing you change the TV channel with? My fucking fist! What do you call gym shoes? Eternally lonely because he's never gonna find love with a name like Jim Shoes.